nafanya mtongo ndio maana tunakojenga kwenye isho sasa bado pale ulipo mtongo inabidi uwe nasi mpaka mwisho maana tunamzuka kupandisha mziki mtamu na hits kali kutoka kila pembe ya hii sayari so kata tayari ize kupaka hiyo mabibi hot kama hot 96 No I feel like I'm in school. Ni mesquito yari yari. Yo yari ka tayari. Let me tell you. I feel, like, I feel like I just got schooled. Yo. That's crazy talent Mzazi. So how did you get started? How did you get into radio? Um you know I, I had a dream as I told you earlier. Mm-hmm. Uh, I had a dream to be who I am today. Yes. And uh, I thank God because uh, in spite of the challenges that I I, I went through. Mm-hmm at last uh, god opened doors mm-hmm. and i can't say that it came easy kwa sababu <laughs> as i told you ndiko cartoonist eh? yes so um nilikuwa na hii vision ya one day dj kwa mtangazaji mm-hmm. so before that nilikuwa nafanya kazi ya uchoraji mm-hmm. yeah so nikajituma kwenye uchoraji one day call ka come mm-hmm. na nikajipata hapa Mm-hmm. Yeah. So could I through auditions did you do auditions did you send your tapes? Yeah, kuliendaje pale maana nilikuwa mtangazaji so nikiwa Kenya Institute of Mass Communication ah. uh, nilifanya so many things za radio. Mm-hmm. Actually nilikuwa na kipindi kwenye KBC. Mhm. Kilikuwa kinaitwa Afya Bora. Mm-hmm. Afya bora. Yeah. Hiyo ndio mimi. Yaani bwana ikeni kama. Yaani haifarani, haifarani lakini bado tunakifanya. Eh bwana. But I used that opportunity kuweza ku ku, ku ekandoto yangu ya kile kitu ambacho nakifanya. Kwa sababu at that time nilipokuwa na, 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 na naanza mm-hmm. most radio stations were not playing our content, local content. Mm-hmm. Hakuwa na nafasi. Yaani unashare radio unakutana na muziki ambayo inapiga ni kutoka sehemu zingine so ilikuwa ni mwasha mm. so bado nasoma lakini nasema tuko na talanta lakini talanta zetu hazipewi nafasi mm-hmm. na ndio maana nikawa na hiyo ndoto ya kuanzisha mseto mm. mseto yeah. mseto ina maisha nini mseto uh, mseto ina maisha mchanganyiko mm-hmm. wa vitu mbalimbali mm-hmm. Unajua uh, it's a mix. <laughs> I'm laughing because I had no idea. <laughs> <laughs> All right, um, Mseto is a mixture. Mhm. Uh-huh. Uh, Naweza kusema kama ni mixture ya vitu mbalimbali. Uh-huh. Kwa entertainment uh, Mseto ni mixture ya muziki toka East Africa. Uh-huh. Ni mixture yani uh, Naweza kusema kama ni mchanganyiko wa ladha za Afrika Mashariki, uh-huh. Talanta, masuala ambayo yanaathiri vijana na vitu kama hivyo. Uh-huh. Yeah. Acha ni first of all mimi sijaona watu on our facebook page on 96 as in it's not that so ali moja like wa, and then mtu anaandika ki paragraph <laughs> we just ask to about driving to having a show uh, every thursday uh, of course i want uh, to ambia and what's purpose and mission of the show otherwise i love the show exam na ina, ina tutesa mbaya wills <laughs> <laughs> then another very long one mm-hmm. mzazi una to inspire sana mm-hmm. what was your first step uh, step after you realize your dream because my it wengi wako na goals but wameshindwa what do maybe because of their background madre na kazalika mm-hmm. yani nashika hizi mna watu ina load another long one uh-huh. <laughs> hey raburu say hi to two of us this has reminded me of something way back in school and i said ma Oh, I had to remind the story. Nina said, "I can't forget a slap I received from my mom because of a compliment about Tuva." <laughs> <laughs> I said Tuva is very cute and my mom slapped me. <laughs> <laughs> oh, when he was in when he was when he was cross sports during half half time. <laughs> Why I deserve an apology, Terry. Don't dare laugh at this again. It's not funny. <laughs> Yeah, I told Chelsea Tiffany. I can tell you for sure he's cute, he's cute. He's oh, cute. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> okay, acha ni hivi baadhi ya maswali eh. Um na nitajibu kwa utaratibu kama ngazi eh. Kama kupanda ngazi. Sio jamii mzazi. Na. So lazima ni nipande ngazi. Utaratibu. <laughs> okay. Uh, na tusema ni kwamba Unajua so many young people mm-hmm. wanapitia changamoto in life na wanakuwa na dreams lakini zinakosa kuwa achieved because wanakata tamaa. Mm-hmm. We all have dreams. Mm-hmm. Unajua kuna point ilifika mimi kwa kama nilikuwa kwa mtu kukata tamaa ningekata tamaa. Mm-hmm. Unajua ile unajihisi kwamba una talanta, you have mm-hmm. everything. Mm-hmm. You have a, you have a program. Unajua hii mseto nilikuwa nimeandika proposal nilikuwa natembea na na uh, kitabu I feel you. Yaani unaelewa? Yeah. Yaani niko na hii dream nimeweza chuo, nimeweza kusoma utangazaji. 
niko na idea tayari nime put into paper mm -hmm. lakini naipeleka kwenye different radio stations mimi kwa sababu nimezunguka radio stations na wapati idea mseto mhm mm unajua lakini vi, na shida mbona hawaniiti mm -hmm. naenda kwenye stations kubwa stations ndogo na pia na idea na wapati na wambia niko na hii lakini hawanipi nafasi na shindo ai jamani ndio tu nayo naenda nafunga you know used to fast uh -huh. nafunga kula nikiomba Mwenyezi Mungu nijalie nitimize hii ndoto ya mseto mhm mm azinije kufanya hichi kitu lakini it things don't work siku zinaenda ndio I, i was doing cartoons mm -hmm. <laughs> lakini unajua ukiona ndoto when you want to achieve something mm -hmm. you have to achieve na kuwasha yeah So I feel like kutoka ndio 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 kwenye mchanga kwenye madaftari mpaka nimaliza so I have this dream to be on radio but why kwa nini station hazinichukui yeah so one day <laughs> nikiona na, nachora <laughs> nilikuwa kwenye chumba changu <laughs> <laughs> those days nilikuwa naishi umo mm -hmm. umoja one inako plot 99 Alina kufunga plot number. Ni namba 3. Hey. Shout out to you you did that. Kama uko hapo sasa hiyo tu ndio alikuwa the first kukoa huko ndani. Ah ni nguri mwana wa kazi hapo. So ah na ukumbuke kwamba hata nikiingia kwenye hicho hicho chumba, nikiingia kwenye nyumba, niliingia nikiwa na ndoto. Nilikuwa sina pesa za kufanya kununua viti, sikuwa na pesa za kununua kitanda, sikuwa na all that but I said naenda kukodisha nyumba iko na bedroom sitting room na kitchen hata kama sina pesa hata kama nyumba ina curtain lakini kwa sababu i have a dream that one day mm -hmm. itakuwa na sofa itakuwa na kitanda cha maana na kitchen ambayo inaeleweka so i have that dream so ilipoelea chocho kitu kimoja baada kingine kikaji mm -hmm. kikajileta so nikikaa pale siku moja nikapigiwa simu <coughs> nilipigiwa simu nikaambiwa hello how are you <laughs> kasema poa ya shindizi mtoto kike. Hello how you my name is Gakenya I'm calling you from Radio Citizen. Radio Citizen. Nikashindwa eh wewe utakuwa unatakeni na niambia I'm calling you because my boss wants to see you. Your boss wants to see me? Nikakata simu nikamwambia okay when Where <laughs> nika pro directions ni hata simu nikarudi nikiwa nimefry. Mm -hmm. So the next day nikaja kuja hapa uh, nika nikaitwa kwenye nilikuwa nimeambiwa nije kumuona marehemu wa Irumburu mm -hmm. na Freda Fune. Mm -hmm. So wakaniita ndani kwenye <laughs> chumba fulani hapo. Ndani <laughs> kabisa. <laughs> <laughs> Wakaniuliza jina, nikajitambulisha unaitwa nani? Na mimi ndiko atiri kana maneno. Unajua yani yani mtu kiweza kitu ingoa inatoka so I, I had that passion. Mhm. Wakaanza kutokea wapi nikamwambia um sisi tuna uh, th that time radio season was changing from an English station to uh -huh a Swahili station. Mm -hmm. So they were looking for talent, people who can bring in new ideas and so waliponiuliza what can you do? So nikatirika nikajeleza nikamwambia my vision ni hii. Mm -hmm. Sasa nikatoa vision ya mseto. Yes. Kwamba at the moment ukiangalia Kenya kuna mm -hmm. muziki na wasanii wazuri sana. Mm -hmm. Lakini hapo nafasi ya kutosha. Mm -hmm. Tanzania bongo flavor mm -hmm. ina beta, ina uwezo. Uganda so kuna need kwamba hii muziki ipewe nafasi. Mm -hmm. So this is my my dream. I said it in words. Very few words but I think that's how mseto was born. The next day nikaja kuitu uh, actually the same day kama ni ngapo production uh, nikaingiza sauti mm -hmm. nikaja kwa mahojiano mengine ya siku ya pili baada hapo nikaja kuta kazini na ndio maana mseto ipo kwenye radio na baadaye mseto mambo mseto ikazaa mseto East Africa, Africa. Yes. kwa sababu niliko na hiyo vision na bado niliko na vision zingine mm -hmm. ikazaa mseto East Africa kwenye Citizen TV mm -hmm. na sasa hivi mseto Africa <laughs> yeah. So it is not just uh, the most important thing that I have to It's not just uh, at waking up you told no ah bas so msema na wacha ndio ndani. The guy was even fasting until yeah. you. For you know, a believer. Uh -huh. Yeah, I believe in God. I I, I really pray, pray pray a lot. Uh -huh. I take time to pray every day. Uh -huh. And I believe that in everything that I have achieved is because I believe in God. Uh -huh. Yeah. So when you put God first. Na sasa kuna kitu kinaweza kila kushinda. Mm -hmm. Yaani unasema kilichopangwa na Mungu wa kipingu ina mtu. 
Ah. Shaskeyo. Hey, hey. Eburudia kwanza tena. Si hey hey tu hapa. Hey hey. Kicho pangwa na Mungu. Hakizui, hakizui. Hakipingwi. Hakipingwi na mtu. Eish. Wakala hapa. Mtendo ni mtendo ni mtendo. Ndio ni wakala uzito. Tutemine, ndio. Si ni wakala uzito. Okay. 